I have not always been a reader and I can attest to this because in school I never completed a book. When I was assigned any sort of work in college, even in graduate school, I never truly finished everything because the fact of the matter is that there's a point where you know that you're wasting your time reading something that's just not interesting. Out of that came this passion for literature. All of you that know me know that I love books. If you don't, my name is Luis D. Martinez. I am an avid bookworm, a nerd at heart, a runner, not a father, a cookie and cake consumer. So my passion for books started back in 2009 where I was just sitting in my dorm. I'm thinking, what are things that I've never done? What are goals that I want to set, things that I want to complete? And one of them for that year was basically reading a book from cover to cover. At that point in my life, I never completed an actual adult book, even a young reader's book, from cover to cover. And I started challenging myself to read a book. The first book that I officially read was Peter Pan. That book showed me how much I didn't know about reading. The words were a little bit complicated for my vocabulary. Mind you, Peter Pan is a young reader's book. I'm here a junior in college not being able to read Peter Pan without stuttering, without looking up words. And that in and of itself motivated me to say, you know what? I need to get better at reading. I need to be a much more efficient reader. And when I was in school, I never struggled. I didn't struggle with reading. I was not that student. But again, my interest in reading was not there. Nothing piqued my interest. So I never read books. So after Peter Pan, the next book was Charlotte's Web. I bought this book, I cried, and I love this book. Every single new year, I read this book from cover to cover. I'm gonna get back to that, but let me keep going. After Charlotte's Web, then Harry Potter, I got consumed with Harry Potter, and I kept buying books. So eventually, I have, I think, over four or 500 books. I've given some away, but long story long, I decided to launch this book club to share the fact that these things, it's just paper and glue and ink. These things provides every single person that picks up a book with the opportunity to learn something. To get this stuff that's called the brain, this jelly in here inside of our skulls. To feel better. To learn something. And the highlight and I think the, the biggest inflection point when you're a reader is being able to turn that last page and say, wow, I completed this book. It's such a great euphoric feeling. I don't know how to describe it, but you should experience that. Pick up a book and just read it from cover to cover. Don't stop, even if it's a bad book, you're gonna learn something. And the reason this book is my favorite, Charlotte's Web, it is a kid's book. I can read this book in one sitting, probably in two hours, I can get through this book. It teaches you about friendship. It teaches you about how essential it is to have these relationships. When you're feeling lonely, when you're not feeling good, when you're not feeling good, the people that care for you are your friends, your family, and they're always gonna show up for you. And I love this book because it teaches you so much. When you go from nothing to something important, and then you lose somebody that's close to you. And with this book club, with everything that I'm saying, my friends inspire me because now it's gotten to a point that people know that I am a reader. People share, hey, I bought a couple of books. What do you think? And it's so cool to, it's so cool to be in a position where people come and ask me for a book recommendation or, hey, I completed this book. I think you should check it out. And I like that. And the purpose of me sharing this stuff is because again, these things make us so much better. You're having a bad day, you don't wanna to talk to people, you don't even have to use your phone. Sit down somewhere, outside, under a tree, in some shade, at the beach, under some shade, whatever. Pick up a book and I'm telling you, you're gonna feel so much better. I found so much comfort in books when I was at my lowest point in life when I was lonely, when I was struggling with certain parameters of my life or certain aspects of my life. And just being able to have the ability to go order a book or go to a bookstore, 
pick something that's interesting that somebody wrote. Whatever topic it is, it can be science, it can be romance, it can be nonfiction, fiction, historical, whatever. So many great books are out there. All you have to do is just pick up the book, make some time for it, and learn something. Be open-minded. And that's the best thing, to be open-minded toward every aspect of life when you're reading. I think that's one of the greatest benefits of reading. And with this book club, every single Saturday, I'm going to push this because, again, I want to share this. I want to pick up a book, regardless of length. This is not about finishing 100 books or 1,000 books in a day or in a year or in a week, whatever. This is not a competition. This is just me sharing, hey, I'm reading this book. This is what I find interesting in this book. These are the things that I sort of disagree with this book. I would recommend it. I don't recommend it. I highly recommend it. Whatever. That's the type of conversation that I want to sort of formulate around this book club. And again, you, the person that's viewing this, suggest some books to me. I want to get to a point where we are forming dialogue in the comment section. So if you want, comment. If you want, subscribe. If you don't want to, cool. But every single Saturday at 10 a.m., I am going to be talking about books. I'm still debating whether it should be live to make it a little bit more interactive with whoever's watching or some sort of round table. I don't know, but I'm really leaning toward it being live at 10 a.m. every single Saturday. I don't know yet. I still got to work the idea in my head, but yeah. I am happy to be able to share the power of books with you. It's just fun. And in the coming weeks, I'm going to work on an intro. I'm going to work on some theme music, whatever. But I just wanted to get this out there. This is the book club. And we're going to be reading a whole bunch of books, sharing a whole bunch of ideas. The more I share with you, the smarter you'll be. And if you're smart and you share with me, I'm going to get smart too. So this is about just sharing. That's it. See you soon. Make sure you're reading your book.